she left her for dead after she framed her for a drink driving crash sending her life into free fall and almost causing her to lose her daughter, so you'd imagine EastEnders Linda Carter, played by Kelly Bright, would be delighted to see Janine Butcher, Charlie Brooks, finally face justice. However, in scenes to be aired next week the magnitude of what she has been through in recent months finally catches up with her. Next Monday Alfie, Shane Ritchie, notices how down she is, which is understandable as Janine is being sentenced. Following dramatic scenes the scheming minx was arrested at Christmas after being turned in by her brother Ricky, Sid Owen. The always amiable Alfie tries to cheer up staunch royalist Linda with coronation party talk, but she doesn't want to know. A worried Alfie confides in Jean Slater, Jillian Wright, about the fact that Linda is struggling and is given a few home truths. She tells him in no uncertain terms that Linda's issues are because she is serving a life sentence of her own without Mick, Danny Dyer. Later when Linda is shaken by Janine's sentencing, Alfie tries to console her, but she is too consumed by her loss to let him help. In a move that is completely out of character for her she breaks the bad news that she can't face throwing the coronation party without her beloved Mick. Undeterred, Alfie continues in his efforts to convince her to host a celebration but to no avail. Don't miss! Emma celeb fans fume Ant and Deck went too far with Sean Ryder joke, insight, inside life of the repair shop's Susie Fletcher including tragic loss, insight, Coronation Street's Stephen Target's victim as Elaine held hostage, spoiler, despite her resolve Coronation fever has well and truly hit Walford and she can't escape it. Billy Mitchell, Barry Fennick, is at the heart of the excitement and he too decides to try and persuade the reluctant landlady to mark the occasion. He makes it his mission to break her resolve and convince her to host a party in the Vic and comes up with an idea of a royal walkabout for the kids of Walford. He also tugs at Linda's heartstrings by making a beautiful gesture to include Mick in the celebrations. Will this be enough to persuade her to change her mind or will the Vic remain a coronation-free zone? King Charles and Queen Camilla previously made a guest appearance in Albert Square in May last year. The then Duke and Duchess of Cornwall made a special cameo as part of celebrations to mark the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. The soap also featured a new take on the iconic theme tune at the end of the episode. East Enders is on BBC One, Monday to Thursday at 7.30pm.